Greetings and welcome to this brand new video. So since many of you asked me here as a full guide on how to install and set up NoCut Mobile which will allow you to tweak or customize your iOS devices without a jailbreak on device without requiring a computer. Yes, for the very first time a computer is required and I will show you the same. We are following the Windows method. NoCut Mobile is completely free and you can see we are at its official github page also this video is only for educational and research purposes so please use the information responsibly also make sure that before you use this nougat mobile please make a backup of all your data using itunes so if in case anything goes wrong you can always restore your data also before you apply any tweaks or customizations please make sure if you use it please turn off find my iphone and after you have applied the tweaks or customizations make sure you turn it on it is safe to do so then all right so first things first open the official github page for nogat mobile as you can see it right here simply go to releases first and from here get the nougat file nougat.ipa to your computer as you can see i already done so now to install it you can use sideloadly sideloadly is completely free you can get it from its official website simply scroll down and first of all install itunes from here you will see these official links and you also need iCloud you can get it from here this is also the official link and then from here you can download and then install sideloadly you can also visit the official Apple's website to get iTunes also if you install it from the Microsoft Store please uninstall it and get it from the official Apple's website as you can see I already got iTunes and I installed it all right once sideloadly is set up please connect your device via USB as you can see I have this iPhone 12 which is on iOS 18.1 currently so now I will simply drag and drop the nougat.ipa here or I can simply left click this button and select the file from here also and then hit open now here please enter your Apple ID any Apple ID should work then hit start and if you are doing this for the first time please type in your password now as you can see done here and the Nougat app is on device now now the very next thing simply scroll down on the official GitHub page and from there get this jitter bug pair you will see this here simply open in a new tab go to and then scroll down and for windows get this file jitter bug pair win 64.zip as you can see i already got it simply right click and then extract all now open the folder for jitter bug pair open a new terminal right click then left click on open in terminal all right now simply connect your device via usb and keep it unlocked then dot slash then simply run this file jitter bug pair dot xe press enter you will see this message now on your device hit trust then up arrow press enter and if you see this message simply go to settings then passcode then simply set a passcode all right the passcode is set now up arrow hit enter and you will see this message is success and here you'll find the pairing file which you will need now you will have to transfer this file to your device please use itunes because if you use any other method it will not work the simplest method is to 
go to app store then search for iZip and install it it is completely free you can see it on my device I already installed it you can see it here also now simply open iTunes after installing iZip on your device now hit file sharing here you'll find iZip here now simply hit add file now select the pairing file you just got then hit open and the file will be transferred to your device into iZip now from here rest of the process is on device open Safari and head to the official github page for Nogurt mobile again scroll down and simply get this from the app store it is completely free install it you can see I already installed it on my device now from the official github page get the site store config file download to your device now open this app hit this button then create from file in downloads select this config file allow and then simply turn this button on now you before you open nogurt go to settings general scroll all the way down to device management and trust the app from here once the app is trusted come out into settings then go to privacy and security and simply turn on developer mode you will see developer mode only after you have installed the nogat app from the side loadly once you get it please turn it on if you don't know i have linked a complete guide on how to turn on developer mode on ios 18 if you want to check it out now simply open nogat now from here first of all select pairing file now in browse go to on my iphone you will see izip open this folder and you will see your pairing file you just transferred from itunes to izip all right you can see it is done now hit tools then select one of the tweaks or customizations you want to apply then hit modify here now for example i will enable charge limit and always on display then go home then make sure these buttons are on then hit apply and now if everything goes well you will see this verbose on your device and then your device will reboot all right so after the reboot you can see always on display on my device is working you can also see it in settings display and brightness you can see it is on you can turn it off if you want also as we turned on the charge limit i'll go to battery charging you can see it is on and works now on your device whenever you want to enable or disable tweaks or customizations you will have to open this app then simply turn this button on go back then open nugget and then perform your customizations or tweaking to your device and if you want to return back to stock it is easy you can simply hit remove all tweaks button and then hit remove tweaks button you will again see the same verbose on your device and then your device will reboot and once your device gets back on you can see always on display is now off and now if you check out settings display and brightness you can see the device is back on stock same is the case with the charge limit i will go to battery and you can see it is back to stock also the same method same tutorial applies to any other app which uses this method to tweak or customize the device without a pc on device that's all for this video if you still have questions please ask in the comment section and i will reply you as soon as possible i will see you in a new video goodbye and take care